can go Dallas and we're gonna go check out the Black Friday deals. It is currently 7.54, they open at eight. I am super duper excited, so let's head on in. Here we go. The major sale that they had for Black Friday is a buy more, save more, where if you spend so much, you get so much off. Besides that amazing deal, they had multiple sales tables set up. So these were a lot of things that were on sale. They had truly neat items. They had historical character items. They had some big ticket items even on sale. They had a lot of Corinne stuff. And then they even had some truly meat all, such as number 87 and some of the street chic girls. And we have more Corinne's collection along with, Glenn, with Gwen, her little sister. They had those dolls on sale and, Gwen, and Corinne herself on sale as well. And then here's another look. They also had some Willy Wishers and stuff for girls on sale. And then they also had some Black Friday specials, such as the Truly Me Kitchen was on sale for two for 210, along with the Day at the Cafe set for 89, no wait, $98. I thought that was an amazing deal. We had the pet shop on sale for 175. I always love a pet shop. I thought it's so cute. I would love to have it in my collection someday. I just thought it was just adorable. And then we had some of the World by Us sets on sale, such as the Community Center for 98. And then we had some historical character dolls on sale. Molly, Courtney, Samantha, and Kit, I think were the only four that was on sale. They actually had like a bundle of Kit stuff on sale too for $110. So that was really awesome. They had Julie's basketball court for 45. They had Rebecca's bed for 98. I always love Rebecca's bed. I thought it was so cute. We had a couple of Nenea stuff. Her uh, table was for 60 and then her shave ice stand was for 62. I've always wanted this and now we're gonna get into the new items they had. They had the new American Girl doll carrying case. They recently updated this and they came out. And then we had, I thought this was new. I've never seen it before. It's just like this Willy Wisher bundle. Kind of looks like it's like in a Costco set. So I thought that was interesting. They did have the outfits from the archives, um, the American Girl Encore outfits. I know that was available for 24 hours and they came out with them again. And then they actually had this like donut accessory set. So this is what you would get if you would purchase the dolls from Costco. So now we're going to be taking a look at the new store. If you watched my last video on American Girl Dallas, you will know that they are moving to a new location. This store is supposed to open up next year, early in 2024. They do have a grand opening date. It is yet to be announced, and it's going to be announced very, very soon. So I had to stop by the new store to see what it looks like. Um, a lot of the stuff, the kind of covering that says American Girl coming 2024, that has been pushed out a bit compared to last time. Um, so that is very interesting. They also have permits up. I know on the second level, they I don't think they had a permit up. Now they do. On the bottom floor, um, they had more permits up than last time as well. So that is very interesting, I thought. I'm very glad that we are, like, getting into, like, I don't know. It just looks really exciting, and I'm super duper excited for the grand opening. Now, they did have the windows blocked off, so you cannot walk or drive and get right next to the windows to look in, but coming in from, like, the main road, you can see inside. So, this is kind of a night vision of what it looks like with the lights on, because they did leave the lights on, so you can kind of see a little bit inside, and then kind of at the beginning of the video, you could see a little bit inside, too. Um, this, it just looks awesome. They do have peeking in it looks like they have walls up so i'm very excited to see like the floor plan good morning everyone we just got back from american girl dallas and we are now in the doll room um and i'm gonna show you what i got because i'm really excited first of all i want to say ag dallas was amazing we oh my goodness i've never been to american girl store on black friday which is so weird to think about because you'd think i would have went to kansas city for black friday since when they were open it was only three hours away but i didn't so anyways it's just one of those things where i was just like I'm really excited that I got to go to American Girl Dallas for Black Friday. It was awesome. I enjoyed it. They had the same deals as online, but, you know, I love to get stuff in person, if that makes sense. Like, I, I'm really bad about, I do have patience. I like to say that, but, you know, there's just something about going to American Girl and just 
picking stuff out and like the whole shopping experience, getting to interact with others who love dolls or maybe who are Christmas shopping. It's just a blast. It was awesome. I really loved it. Um, all the employees were nice. The displays were so cute, so well put together. I don't know what else to say other than it was amazing. I did get to check out the construction site. That was really fun too. Getting to see the new store. I'm so excited for the grand opening. Oh my gosh. And the grand opening is going to be here before you know it. So I'm excited. Okay, so the first thing I got is the new doll carrying case. Oh my goodness. I had to get this because it is so cute. I love it. I love the cute little star that's like rainbow. The rainbow straps. Hello. This is me all over American Girl right now. Like, and then there's the new logo on it. Um, I really like this. I really think it's cute. And I actually needed another doll carrying case. This is my old one. I mean, this is the one I still will most likely use because it's just, it's so cute and I love it. And I love how it looks like a doll box. Like, it's just super duper cute. But I'm really glad that I have two now because sometimes I do end up taking two dolls on a trip. It makes it hard when I only have one carrying case. So now I'm glad I have two so then I can like fully be covered and like, you know, yeah. Okay, second thing I got, which I actually was like roaming around and I saw this by the checkouts and I was like, oh, I should probably get this because I need more of these. Doll, a doll stand. I just ordered one. The, uh... In October for that birthday purchase but I thought I better get another one because you never know I would love to uh, Penelope needs one she's in the sage area who else needs one like so many so many dolls so I was like okay well I better get might as well get one while I see it I was really proud of that purchase of <laughs> getting the doll stands because sometimes I can never I can never remember them okay so I thought the birthstone outfits were super duper cute life goal of mine is to get all of them because they are stunning and they are gorgeous. So this trip, I was like, okay, my focus is going to be on the birthstone outfits. But then American Girl had a sale. And then they came out with the troll stuff. I was like, okay, I'm going to try to get some birthstone outfits on this trip. Um, because some, because not only are they, like, gorgeous, but they're also, like, really fancy. And, like, really fancy, um, in my definition, really fancy, it means I could use them for Christmas outfits. And... I have a little dolls to dress. We are surrounded by dolls that needs to be dressed for Christmas and needs outfits. So I got a couple birthstone outfits that I thought looked Christmassy enough to dress. But here's the thing. I think they all could work personally. So this is the April one. This is diamond. Oh my goodness. This is so stunning. Look at this jacket. This jacket it reminds me of the Karma jacket that Car that Taylor Karma wears, Taylor Swift wears when she performs Karma on the Eras tour. Like August is gonna want to wear this. Like oh my gosh, like this is so cute. Like I love that outfit. Okay, and then the next one I got, I only got three, or maybe did I get four? No, I got four. Never mind. Okay, this is Ruby. This is July's. This is super duper cute. I love it. You know, once again, like a Christmas red, you know, super duper cute. I love the jacket. I love like the little fringe on it. I just think that is just adorable with like the cute little boots. Oh, I just love it. Okay. Next one, I got the, the other red one, which is for January. This is super duper cute. I love the cute little skirt, but yeah, I just, I just really love this. I think it's just a Adorable. And then the last first done outfit I got is the August one, this green lovely dress. Oh my goodness. I've always wanted American Girl to come out with a green Christmas dress. Always wanted it. Still want them. Like, and you might be like, well, we had green Christmas dresses in the past. We had Molly's and we had Ruthie's. And that's the only green Christmas dress that we ever had. And I really want a truly me green Christmas dress. Like, it's just, I don't know. I just think it would be so cute and it would be stunning it'd be gorgeous. And, like, I have a lot of expectations for just a green Christmas dress because I just, I just really want one. And I want it to be, like, a new, like, design pattern. Like, I want it to be, like, bam. You know, well, it would be BAM because it would be green. Like, they've never done green, but you know what I mean. Anyways, it's just, it just needs to happen. It just... Next thing I picked up is the Trolls Pajamas. Oh my goodness, this is, like, so cute, okay? First of all, I love the rainbow. 
Rainbow is my queen. Like, I, I love Rainbow, like, so much. And so, to see that this is, like, pastel Rainbow, I had to get it. I've only seen the Troll movie a couple times, and that was when I was at work, because I work in childcare. Um, I'm not, I mean, it's not my favorite movie. I'm not a big Troll person, but I am a big Rainbow person, so they got me on that. I will say that. I wanted to get the Trolls dress, but they were sold out. And then, hopefully I can get the Trolls dress, because it's sold out online, too. So, yeah, I really wanted that, because it's, like, sequins, and it reminds me of Taylor Swift, and I just, I just like it. The next thing I got from the Trolls collection, which is the last thing, is the cute little sleeping bag. Um, it's the American Girl Extreme Works Trolls Rainbow Stripes Sleeping Bag Set, and it's, like, rainbow stripes, and it's really cute, and it comes with, like, a cute little troll stuffed animal. So, I thought this was adorable. I mean, I had to get the sleeping bag with the pajamas. So, this is the first thing that was on sale. This was for 50% off, and I've wanted this for a while. So, this is the Willy Wisher Princess Dress Up Outfit Set. This is 50% off, okay, and it's super, super cute. I had to buy this because not only was it on sale for, like, 50% off, but I've always wanted it. I think it's super, super cute. I usually don't buy Willy Wisher stuff at AG. I usually wait until it goes on sale at Barnes & Noble. Next thing I got is, and this is something I've been wanting for a while, and it was on sale, the Truly Me Student Council election set. Oh my goodness, I've wanted this since it came out, okay? And I think it's just adorable. Like, little, like, vote stuff, and, like, the table. Oh. And then the last thing I got, which I cannot really show you because it's in kind of a big box, it's Nenea Shave Eye Stand. Ah! Oh my gosh! I've been wanting it for a while. And there was a couple few times where I did came close to purchasing it, but I just, I, I didn't. I'm really happy I have it. Alrighty, everyone. So that was this week's video. I am super duper sorry if I was chaotic. I felt like I was really chaotic filming. I'm excited to um, have all this in my collection. I'm excited for the holidays. I'm in the process of currently dressing my dolls. I'm running a bit behind this year. Like, not a bit behind, a lot behind, I'm going to be honest. So, I hope I get all my dolls dressed this year, and I hope I get, uh, I'm able to get Christmas out. We'll see, hopefully, because it's my favorite thing to do in the doll room. Thanks for watching this video, everyone. I hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on my Instagram if you haven't done so already. It's the same name, Dollies and Rainbows. Uh, check me out on TikTok as well. We're on there. Um, check out my doll mom podcast. It's really fun, really cute. Give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Comment down below if you've ever been to AG on Black Friday. If you've never been, have you ordered anything from AG Black Friday sales before? I know I've done some online shopping during Black Friday for them, and it's always been great. And yeah, I think that's it. I think that's all I have to tell you. I'll see you next time. Bye! <laughs>